an ABC News exclusive. President Obama one on one with our Robin Roberts. She asked the president what he makes of the violent protests, the growing tension and how to bridge the divide with police. What we have seen recently in Charlotte, North Carolina, young people rising up mm -hmm. and showing their frustration right. in a different way. Mm -hmm. When you and the rest of the world sees that, what goes through your, your mind? Well, I, I think it's important to separate out um, the pervasive sense of frustration uh, among a lot of African Americans about uh, shootings of people and, and the sense that justice is not always uh, uh, you know, colorblind. The way we change the system uh, requires us to be able to uh, reach out and engage the broader American community. And that requires being peaceful. That requires being thoughtful about what are the specific reforms you're looking for. The overwhelming majority of people mm -hmm. who've been uh, concerned about police community relations uh, doing it the right way. Every once in a while you see folks doing it the wrong way. By the way, that first debate, as I mentioned, four days away now right here on ABC. As I mentioned, Robin did ask the president any advice for Hillary Clinton with up to 100 million people expected to watch. It's Monday night. It's game time. Secretary Clinton is about to take the stage with the debate. What would you want to say to her before walking out for that first debate? Be yourself and explain what motivates you. Uh, because I, I will tell you, uh, I've gotten to know Hillary uh, and seen her work and seen her in tough times and in good times. Uh, she's in this for the right reasons. I think uh, there's a reason why we haven't had a woman president before and so she's having to break down some barriers. Uh, there's a level of mistrust and a caricature of her that just doesn't jibe with who I know this person that cares deeply about kids. Robin's entire exclusive interview with President Obama tomorrow morning right here on Good Morning America.